All right, guys, we are flying the Blenheim Bomber on Hamada. Wait, is that the name of this map? Yeah, Hamada on Conquest. So I've been playing it with it a bit. It's nowhere near as good as the German JU-88. And look, it's so much slower that the aiming reticule is really hard to see in first person. And as you know from my last video, the aiming reticule is so important. Uh, but hopefully we can get some tank kills. I am scanning for some targets. I'm not seeing any targets on the ground. I'm guessing they would have spawned themselves closer to the front line. So let's go back over the front line. Let's see what we can see. Yep, I see a tank. Enemy spotted. Let's see if we can put a spot on him so that we can just make sure we always see him. Now we're going to need altitude so that we can dive a bit. So we have the first person view. Ah, we missed. We missed. Did we miss? We got some track disabled. So we didn't fully miss. What have we got? We've got four... 250 pound bombs Okay, let's see if we can get him again. This it's so much slower than the the Yunkers 88. I much prefer the Yunkers 88 So I don't know the value of this Blenheim, but I've noticed There's also the mosquito on the British side that you can only unlock when you get to a higher rank and so I'm gonna guess I did see a bunch of infantry there. We got a four-man kill <laughs> So I'm gonna guess that the uh, mosquito is gonna be much better at air to ground than this Blenheim Bomber and, uh, and if you look at the other variant of the Blenheim Bomber, it's got some weird specialization upgrades like You can allow people to para drop from it So it really suggests that the Blenheim is expected to be a support vehicle and if you want to go on the offensive Then we're gonna need to unlock the mosquito, but I am NOT on the rank that you need To get the mosquito. I, I still got some unlocking to do guys Let's bomb that same line again. Hope for, hope for the best. We got an enemy hit But we didn't get a kill See, it's hard to spot enemies. We already know this, though, don't we? Yeah, just the general speed as well of this Blenheim bomber. You can tell it's so much slower. And so, it just really is just a support vehicle, isn't it? Come on, where is the enemies? Let's scan this flag over here. Scanning for flags. We're going at a bit of an angle so that we've got we can see past like the uh, fuselage. Otherwise, it's taking up too much of our screen. I'm not seeing them, dude. Where are they? We're fortunate that we're not being harassed by enemy aircraft. That's normally a problem. All right, that's a tank. Is it? Shit, has a tank. Yeah, <laughs> my guy just said it's a tank. Is he still alive? Well, I'm about to bomb him. No, the tank's down. I was too late to the party. Much too late. Let's get the resupply. Maybe we should just focus on infantry. Getting tanks with this thing is really hard because you just don't have visibility of your reticule in first in th in the third person, which we are in right now. Compared to this, look, guys, this is the first person reticule, but we already know it's broken. Let's let's go for this guy. He's going really slow. He's really pulled back on the throttle here. Let's ignore him and go for the. See, that's the Yunkers 8. This guy's got the better air-to-ground vehicle. Must be nice, dude. Oh no, he's got a back seat. I'm in trouble. He can, t he can even turn faster than me. And now I've made that BF109 angry with me. What have I done? I've, I've opened Pandora's box here. Okay, okay. Ah, I see some men. Did I get anyone? Yeah, we got a four-man on the ground. Missed. And missed this dogfight. Brilliant. We also got a an achievement in origin. And look, there's the BF109. He's probably gonna want to kill me now that he's got, his, you know, now that he's seen me. You know, goldfish attention spans and whatnot. There's a guy here. Let's get him. He might have some friends. Hmm. No cigar. We got a. Okay, that BF109 does want us. We have no choice. We have to jump seat. And then we can turn into him, maybe. We've got the instant repair on our damaged wing. Can we turn into him and finish him? And maybe teach him a lesson for shooting at me. Oh, he's smoking. He's going to go down. I'm not going to get the kill. He'll probably jump. Yeah, he's jumping. Oh, look at him. He's still jumping. Look, well done for jumping. Where did you go? You're out of bounds. <laughs> You bastard. 
All right, we still got to... No, we need to resupply the bomb still. Look at this, guys. There's a resupply point under the bridge. Oh, uh, no, no. I've got two big wings. My wings are way too big to go through that. I think. <laughs> I'm not going to risk it because we're on a kill streak and I can click make the hell out of this video if I get 100 kills, right? <laughs> Without dying. Uh, it's just jokes, guys. I'm not that... Uh... <laughs> I'm not that disgusting, yeah? Or am I? Uh, let's see. There's an anti-air gun. Let's just go kill the anti-air gun. I love doing this with the Yonkers 88, and we're just going to do it again now. That, That is on target. I just wish we could watch it, but my bomb is too slow. My bomber is too slow at pulling up for me to actually see it. So you might be wondering, you've just noticed there, I went to rank 3 on the Blenheim. I was rank 2 before. So you might be wondering what the upgrades are. And so far, I've got an engine upgrade. Which lets me go faster. But you can also get a different upgrade. Instead of the engine upgrade, it was something I didn't care about. It was a higher rate of fire on this gun. I could have chosen a higher rate of fire on that guy. But I opted out for that because I thought there wasn't much value in it. Given that we're rarely using it. And because I wanted to go down a specific... Uh, line of the tree. Look, there's a car here. Did I get him? No, I just he just passed through where I aimed, which means we were just too late for the party there. Let's see if we can go get the bombs back and get him again. See, I've got the engine upgrade, but what else have I got? I've got one more thing. I'm trying to remember. Oh, yeah, it's uh, automatically repair a wing if it's damaged. Like, who cares, right? It's not very exciting. Oh, really? We're doing this again? He's severely injured, I reckon. How many times are we going to do this, Mr. BF109? If he was a better pilot, he would win the fight, guys. It's not just like an overpowered bomb, I'm pretty sure. We got the kill. I'm sorry, my dude. Can we take a cheeky shot at him? Wow, wing damage 20, but no kill, no sort of damage on him. Ah, oh, there's a tank, there's a tank. Oh, wait, no, I didn't have any bombs. I didn't pass through the resupply, so I had no bombs. Oh, no. Let's get the bombs. That would have been a kill because it was so concentrated. But that's what you get, Nick, for being too slow, dude. For not being organized. Now we've got to get those repairs in because we're taking a lot of damage. Okay. So we've got a friendly wingman in the sky. That's Bixmox in the sky. He's actually a, a subscriber. And he's backing me up today in the sky. That's pretty cool. Thank you, Bixmox. All right. Where is... Mr. Tanky. I'm trying to find Mr. Tanky. That's probably his carcass right there, isn't it? Yeah. Let's go get the anti-air gun and piss him off. <laughs> There's nothing like going head-to-head -head with an anti-air gun and winning because you can just imagine they're raging <laughs> on their keyboard. Here we go. Hello, Mr. Anti-air gun. How are you today? Crap, he did a lot of damage. And I missed. I actually missed. Or he ran away. I think I missed. Okay, so what else can you unlock? What am I aiming for? Well, there's... You can either get, like, a 500 kilo bomb or a 1,000 kilo bomb. Can't remember what it is, but that's what I'm aiming for. There's not much more exciting that you can get for the Blenheim. You don't have, for example, what you can get on the Yonkers 88, which is an AC-130 equivalent gun, whereby you have a gun mounted on the bottom or the side that can shoot at infantry. And the Yonkers 88 has it, but the Blenheim has nothing like that. It's just got a boring, allowing friendlies to pa to jump out and parachute out. So, all right, we must get kills. We only got one kill, but we got a lot of enemy hits. I imagine I was really plastering my bombs all over those red dots, though. Let's see if we can uh, pass back and get him again. What are we seeing? We're seeing a tank. Let's get Mr. Tanky. But look, you can see the fuselage is so damn big. I have no idea what I'm looking at. We got the vehicle destroyed, though. Oh, we got the bogey on us. Always trying to get the ram in, isn't he? I swear he's trying to get the ram. Where did he go? There he is. I'm going to quickly talk and chat to my wingman. Yo, Big Smox, can you take care of this plane in the sky? This is teamwork, guys. Yeah, see, there he goes. <laughs> I'll help him out. Wait. 
Ah, there we go. He's down. He's down. And we see two targets over here. Let's bomb it. We're getting that tank. 100%. Yeah, transport destroyed with a double kill. <laughs> cool. Back in the game, boys. There's another tanky or a transporty. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, there's a lot of guys coming out of that transport. I got a transport destroyed. Enemy hits, but I did not get the kills. I didn't spread my bombs far enough. You could see them completely flying out of that transport. There was loads of them. And I missed them all, man. That sucks. All right, let's go back. So yeah, what I'm really excited for right now, guys, is unlocking the Stuka. I've actually unlocked it now. And also unlocking that Mosquito on the British team. The twin engine bomber, Mosquito, fighter, whatever it is. It looks like it'll be the Yonkers 88 equivalent on the British side. So that's going to be exciting. And if it requires a higher rank to unlock, it must be better, right? Is my thinking. All right, I'm seeing a whole bunch of infantry over here. That's getting kills. We got a huge amount of kills. And then this guy, I don't know what happened. I think we crashed into each other there. <laughs> we did just get a big kill feed there, didn't we? Oh man, okay, let's take care of this guy. That was mad. Two BF109s. Two BF109s, I'm on 12 health. That was a beautiful cinematic though, wasn't it? Holy crap. He's on me again. Am I going to get this repair in time? This guy is uh, a real <laughs> thorn in my side. And my plane's bugging out a bit. It's really uh, feeling a bit glitchy here. If I pass through this resupply, I'll get an emergency repair. Repair back ready to be used again let's go back and help him out because those two bf109s were really ha harassing me here that was bloody cool that was cool thank you wingman i didn't get a kill they jump out man they always jump out but i got the vehicle destroyed they need to i think it's a bug right now that when there's a little animation when you actually click to jump out. So you have to wait for the animation to, to complete of him like opening the window and actually jumping out. And for some reason, as soon as they click it, even though the an animation's running, you get the vehicle destroyed, but you don't get the kill. Even though they're mid animation. So I don't know, it seems like a bug, but that, that's one bug in a list of many bugs right now for this game. But I'm not complaining too much. Okay, we've got it. <laughs> Get out of here, dude. I've done quite a few hits. I don't know where he went. He's somewhere up there. He's jumped out. Look at him go. <laughs> cheeky, cheeky. All right, the game's almost over. Let's see if we can get some uh, ground kills here. So this is operations. You might be wondering. This is operations. But in this, unlike Battlefield 1, with grand operations, sometimes the game mode is like conquest, sometimes it's frontline, and it varies. And if you win like the first, the first map in the grand operations, the next map could be like frontlines. So yeah, this is conquest operations, if that makes sense. And I actually prefer non-conquest games when flying aircraft for the obvious reasons that people will be compacted into tight spots. There is, there, oh, there is. Thank you for shooting your bullet, tanky. That's on target. We didn't get the kill. He's still standing. We didn't quite concentrate it, though, in fairness. We need to try and concentrate it. But we were such low altitude and low speed, it was hard to do that. Uh, where is... The resupply, apparently I passed through it because I've got the bombs back. So where is the tanky? I think he's under, he's right underneath me here. Yep, there he is, there he is. So let's try and be weird and go up and down. We'll do a bit of a dive bomb, gain some altitude, even though we're being harassed. Let's see if we can get him. 
Where is he? Ah, I've lost him. He's not shooting anymore. Is he there anymore? Come on, I really want to get the tank kill. Well, that was a cool cinematic once again. Good game, guys. That's the Blenheim bomber. What do you think of it? I think it's not going to be as formidable as the other bombers, but we'll, only time will tell. I can't wait to unlock them and find out. I have the Stuka unlocked now, so that'll be my next video probably if I haven't already released a Stuka video. There's a lot of hype around the Stuka, so I want to get the Stuka one out ASAP, but I haven't recorded anything yet with Stuka, so we'll see what we can do. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Subscribe for more, and also, there's a new feature called Memberships. People have been enjoying these videos with early access one day in advance, so if you want to have that perk plus other perks, just click the Join button below, and uh, hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time, guys. Peace.